What up? It's your boy Hack to the Tech to the Get That Check 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 and Check Check. And you know what it is. You know how I do. Always rocking the P O L O P L O style, kid. Yo, check it out, man. I just want to talk about just one thing couple things actually but um let's start with this let's start it with this uh this um noriega and math hoffa interview that i saw you know what i mean um where nori was talking about like he can never do an interview with cuban link you know, from the Terror Squad, he used to he used to be Big Pun's right hand man. Like Big Pun brought him along with him when Fat Joe signed him. You know what I mean? And then, um, unfortunately, uh, Big Pun passed, and Cuban Link was supposed to get ne be next on, and then whatever Fat Joe and Cuban Link had their own blah 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 and. You know, they got into, you know, everybody know what happened. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got to say nothing. But here's my opinion because um, it was brought up um, last week in um, Drink Champs. Noriega was t telling this to um, Matt Hoffa. He said that he would never interview Cuban Link because he's so loyal to Fat Joe. Like, he would never think about it. You know what I mean? Um, but my my thing is, aren't you all about interviewing the legends, Nori? You know what I mean? Interviewing the legends, you know what I'm saying? Not taking it personal. Obviously, obviously there's something personal there. There's something personal there, you know what I mean? There has to be something personal there, you know what I mean? You feel some type of way about Cuban Link. Something must have happened. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? That you're not interviewing Cuban Link. It can't be just because of Fat Joe. I mean, come on. You know what I mean? You interviewed Kanye West. And Kanye West insulted Puff Daddy. And you're on Puff Daddy's platform. You know what I mean? Even though you think... Y'all think y'all own y'all own your own stuff and y'all independent or whatever. No, you are on P Diddy's platform and he is the boss. Period. He's your boss. All right, and you had you you had Kanye on there regardless. And you're telling me you can't bring up Cuban Link, which is a legend. Legend, that that was Big Pun's right hand man, bro. You know what I'm saying? That was Big Pun's right hand man. Regardless what Fat Joe said, you know what I'm saying? And shout out to Fat Joe, because Fat Joe is a legend too himself. But we can't we can't take away. I mean, imagine what I know. I know. I know what Fat Joe's thinking and what you're thinking. Cuban Link is just gonna go up there and bash Fat Joe. You're the interviewer, right? You got control of the questions. And it's up to you what goes on. Every question don't got to be a fat about Fat Joe. Y'all don't even got to talk about the stuff about what happened. Y'all could just talk about pun and about hip-hop and how y'all just started and, and what's going on right now. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't even got to talk about the whole Fat Joe situation. When you have Fat Joe up there, you're not talking about Cuban Link. I mean, in the last in the last interview, y'all did talk about him. Y'all did bring him up. So why can't why can't Cuban Link say his side? And I'm not picking no sides. I love Fat Joe. You know what I'm saying? I love Fat Joe. 
But I'm just saying this is from a fan's point of view. You know what I mean? Like, you should, you should definitely bring up Cuban Link up there. You know what I mean? I don't know why you don't. <clears throat> Matter of fact, Cuban Link should go up there with Chris Rivers. You know what I'm saying? Not the whole family now. Not you know, not not Liza and everybody. Just maybe Cuban Link and Chris Rivers talk up talk some hip hop. You know, give them their flowers. You know what I'm saying? Cause God forbid anything happens to Cuban Link or whatever, and then. So, you know, you're going to feel bad because look what happened with Prodigy. You never got a chance to interview him. You never got a chance to give him your flowers. You know what I'm saying? Give him his flowers. You know what I mean? Because when you wanted him on the show, it was too late. It was too late. You know what I'm saying? So... That's just my opinion on that, man, because um, it's real silly to me. I, these grown men that are in their 50s almost already can't just talk about the passing. Just, I mean, we lost the legend, big pun. If he, if he was still alive, he wouldn't approve of none of this. You know everybody would still be peace. You know what I'm saying? Facts. You know what I'm saying? Y'all all act like a bunch of babies and y'all making all this big money. You know what I'm saying? Y'all make all this big money and you still act like babies. Come on, me. Yo. Y'all make all this money and y'all acting like babies. Come on. Snap out of that, man. Get out of here. We want to hear music. You know what I'm saying? We want to hear the old terror squad. It, it might not happen, but I would love to hear a song with Fat Joe, Armageddon, Prospect, Cuban Link, um, Triple Says, um, um, who else? Tony Sunshine, throw Tony Sunshine in there, throw Remy Ma in there. No, and and rest in peace, big pun, but let's throw Chris Rivers in there. You know what I'm saying? Boom. You know what I'm saying? We have nine dope MCs on one track, but no, people don't think like that. You know what I'm saying? People don't think like that. You know what that would do to the culture? It would do a lot to the hip hop fans, to the Terror Squad fans. It would do a lot for the Bronx. It would do a lot for Queens. It would do a lot for Brooklyn and the whole New York, period. You know what I mean? The whole world, man. Because everybody loved Big Pun, period. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, that's, you know what I'm saying? That's all I got to say about that. You know what I mean? But, I mean, it's Nori's show. He does what he wants. And, I mean, it's just how it goes with him. <clears throat> but, um, I wouldn't, I wouldn't not do it for no other man. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, why are you so loyal to Fat Joe? I mean, it's it's okay to be loyal, like loyal and and um, having his back, and but and you said it yourself, you got no problems with Cuban, you got no beef with him. Why not bring him up there just so he could tell his side of the things? And y'all don't even gotta talk about Joe. And you could even tell him, don't bash Joe. You know what I'm saying? You know? And I bet Cuban Link would be mad respectful and talk his piece, and that's it. I think you know, I think he deserves his flowers, you know what I mean? Just like every other legend, you know what I mean? Let's not, let's not, let's not, let's not give up on Cuban Link, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's not give up on him. Because, I mean, he's a dope MC at the end of the day. He he remind me of Pun, you know what I mean? Like, when he spits, it's just, I'm just, I just, I just get remembered of Pun. Just like Chris Rivers. Just like Fat Joe. You know, they all remind me of Pun. And we can't just leave any of them out. 
You know what I mean? Remy Ma, you know what I mean? Triple Says, Armageddon, Prospect. It's just, they should just all be a big family, man. You know what I mean? There's no unity. Being that this world is so horrible and coming to an end and, you know, people can't find forgiveness and love in their heart. I know it sounds soft right now, but listen, it's just reality, man. You know what I mean? We're losing people left and right. You know what I mean? Like, let's get over this nonsense, man. The fans want to see this. You know what I mean? Now, second thing I wanted to talk about was the Math Hoffa and China Mac thing. All right. Shout out to both of them. I love both their channels of what they got going on. All right. I'm, I'm starting to understand Math Hoffa's side of things more. All right. Math Hoffa's side of things more. I'm starting to understand Math Hoffa's side of things more. All right. Math Hoffa, like I said, like I said, like when Nori is, is the interview. All right. All right. Math Hoffa handles things behind the scenes. All right. You don't want to see Math Hoffa behind the scenes. You know what I'm saying? Because then it's going to get real. You know, with all this stuff going on, you know what I'm saying? People snitching on themselves on camera and blah, blah, blah. You know what I'm saying? Of course, Math Hoffa's not going to be like, I'm a street dude. You know what I'm saying? I'm a street dude. You know what I mean? Like, he, he might not be a street dude no more. You know, China Mac, are you still a street dude? I know you're not. You know what I mean? Come on, you're doing your thing, man. There's no possible way you could be a street dude still, bro. You know, we're getting too old for that. You know, you're a musician and you're a vlogger and you, you're you doing good in it. You know what I mean? You, you know what I'm saying? And I'm, I'm, I'm on your side, bro. I'm also on Math Alpha's side too because he, he don't want to get involved in what 